Hey y'all, Mason here, CNA Games. Appreciate you clicking on the video, supporting the channel, supporting the store. You guys always do. I appreciate you for it. Today, uh, I want to go over some things, and hopefully, hopefully I'm not like breaking some sort of like weird taboo thing. I looked on the terms of service of, of all these websites. I think this is, uh, this is, I think this is okay. If it's not, somebody please email me. Mason at cnagames.com. Let me know. Southern, Southern Hobby, if this is not okay. I don't know if this is okay, So, but I, I didn't see anything that said it's not. But uh, we're going to talk about, you know, there's a lot of speculation on what's in stock, what's not in stock, what is, what can you get out of distribution, what's still available, are we running low on things? I want to go through and show you guys just um, what it, a typical distributor has in stock at any given time. So, and, and Southern Hobby is, is fantastic. I love Southern Hobby. They're my number one. Uh, distrib distributor for a reason. Uh, they have a great website. Uh, they have a lot of great organization for it. Um, Pre-orders is nice and simple. Things I can easily understand. Allocations are, are uh, sent to me and, and explained and, and it all makes sense. It's a great distributor's website that makes a lot of the other distributors look really bad because some of their websites, yikes, it is it is really bad. So this is the, this is um, Southern Hobby's like product page. This is it. Um, and I have cut it off, and sorry if it's a little blurry, because I have a, so I have it zoomed so much that it's probably not in, like, fantastic quality, but, um, this page is, uh, like, where I cut it off to the right of that is exactly, like, where the pricing starts, so I don't want to show the pricing. We all have pretty good ideas of what the margins are on these products. Um, I'm pretty sure I can't show the direct pricing for competitive reasons and things like that. Maybe my price is different from somebody else's, so they don't want to show that. Um, trust me, it's not, it's not any less than yours, but for the, uh, purpose of this, let's just say that it is, or that I don't want to show it just because for that reason alone. So, um, this is Southern Hobby's Pokemon page, just so people can go and see what we have in stock. So, um, if it's grayed out right here, that means that it is out of stock, it's not available. Um, this is the pre-order section. So these are all the things that are coming out here recently. You can see the, the release date, uh, off here, off here to the, uh, the right side here, release date, uh, order due is when I have to put in my numbers. Uh, so you see for a product that is releasing uh, six, or at, uh, in, uh, what's that? Uh, May, June, that's June, June 21st. I have to get my orders in on the 21st of April. So I have two months uh, ahead of time to give them my numbers. Uh, that Palafin box is gonna be a good one. But anyways, that's beside the point. So all the, the Twilight Masquerade stuff and uh, some of the other like events, uh, all these products. Again, if it's grayed out, the picture is grayed out, it's awesome because it means it's out of stock. Uh, but all that stuff is pre-ordered, so it's kind of ir irrelevant, right? So starting this now um, kind of gives you an idea of what they have in stock. Uh, again, if the picture is in color, it's fine, and it's able to be ordered. If it's not, then it means it's out of stock. This is like the great selection that I have to choose from. Uh, and again, this is out of Nashville. I'm out. Nashville is my closest warehouse. If it's available at another warehouse... Um, it will appear in color as well. So it's just, it's not to say if it's if it's completely grayed out, it's, it's available nowhere across Southern Hobby. It's completely out. No one knows when it's gonna come back. Okay, so that's a big setup, I'm sorry. But I wanna explain and have people understand what we're looking at here. So, um, we have the new Iona box. That's a very good box, uh, sold pretty decently well. Very good, um, out of stock. Uh, I can get um, the build and battle boxes. For Tim Bell Forces, it's pretty good. Uh, the Metal uh, Metal, Metal Houndoomy Xboxes, uh, the, the the decks, and the Ninetales and Zapdos, plenty of those to go through uh, and available. That's nice. Um, Three-pack Blister is not available at Nashville, but it is available in the network somewhere. Um, check Lane Blisters uh, are available. I think it's just like single packs like you would see in Walmart and Target. That's what those uh, Check Lane Blisters are. Um, ETBs are out of stock for Tim Bell Forces. Um, Stacking tins are available. Uh, the Adventure Chest, that was, that was an interesting product that, uh, I think PokeRev did a great video on that and talked about that. Uh, Paldean Fates booster bundles. Uh, pretty much anything Paldean Fates is, is not in stock. Uh, not at Southern. Uh, I can't think of anything. I, we'll see. Everything is grayed out here. The, all these here. All the Paldean Fates stuff is out of stock. Not available. I get this Mavastif EX box, though. Big, uh, big seller. I didn't even order it. To let you know. But, uh, and then, uh, this is a little, little interesting product. 
the Pokemon trading card classic. That bad boy, still in stock, has been in stock since release. Nobody wants it at distribution. It was not ever not available. It is just, it's just, just been sitting here. Anybody could have ordered it at any time at our wholesale price. Uh, yeah. That is a, an interesting product that definitely did not do well. All right. That's the end of the first page. Let's go to page two. Page two. Uh, the Roaring Moon Iron Violet Valley box. That's actually a decent box. Has some good playable stuff in there. That's pretty good. Uh, the first booster box that's available is Paradox Rift. Um, yeah, Paradox Rift is uh, widely available. Uh, again, sleeve boosters, uh, things like that. Uh, look at all these things that are not in stock. Oh, it's all the 151 stuff. 151. I can get these. My first battle uh, theme decks box or theme decks though. I got those. But yeah, 151. It's it's been done, been gone. It's not available. Not even. Don't even ask about it. It's, it's not. It's not there. Um, keep on going. Well, now we're down back to like Obsidian Flames kind of era. Obsidian Flames. Uh, yep, I can't get a booster box of that. Um, it is uh, available still. Um, all the build battles, all those other things. Uh, the ETB for Obsidian Flames. It's nice. Um, you know, uh, it's there. If I wanted it, I, I, I'm still sitting on like 60 of these, but it's there if I do want it. Uh, <laughs> keep it moving. Keep it moving. Uh, that would go back to, to uh, Pelty Evolved, uh, Build Battle Stadiums, uh, the, uh, Build Battle Boxes, um, Three Pack Blisters are done. Uh, no Pelty Evolved Booster Boxes right now. That's interesting. Um, Check lane blisters are available, but no, the booster boxes themselves are not available. So the only thing of booster boxes is uh, Obsidian Flames and Paradox Rift right now. Uh, let's see if there's a regular Scarlet and Violet. We'll see on page three. Let's go see. All right. Um, Party Evolved ETBs are out there and available. Um, that's a thing. Uh, okay, Scarlet and Violet. We can't get Scarlet and Violet boosters. I couldn't tell you the last time I sold a Scarlet and Violet booster box. In fact, I don't even think I have any in stock because they they just they don't move. I have so many packs, loose packs available of those. I just I don't I don't even bother stocking the boxes because it's it's nobody cares. Uh, these World Championship boxes. Oh oh boy, I got those. Uh, that's pretty good. Um, Silver Tempest, Lost Origin, all that stuff's done. Good luck. Battle Academies. I get Battle Academies. Uh, and all these things. I like the signage marketing stuff that's all uh, out of stock. So, yeah. Nothing nothing fantastic. A couple of uh, booster boxes um, for, uh, you know, a, a, a high price. Uh, there's no special deals or anything like that. So, uh, that's kind of... Uh, it is what it is. Let's do something hobby. Uh, if it sounds like a lot of stuff out of stock, it is. It's a ton of stuff out of stock. Uh, look, we got 102 items. Um, if I go and switch this and say, hey, show me the only things that are available uh, in Nashville. We can hit that button. We'll see how high of number that 102 goes to. 39. 39 items. And yeah, it's going to be the, a lot of the decks, the the lunch boxes, all that stuff. All the stuff that, you know, sits around. Uh, trainer toolkits. Oh, God. Traumatized from that stuff. But uh, yeah, still sitting around. Uh, that's what there is. None of the other cool stuff or the big selling stuff. No 151 to ever be seen. Uh, it's, uh, yeah. All that stuff is uh, a wrap. Now let's take you to a website that you can go to that you can actually see. You can actually do this yourself. Uh, it's called Magazine Exchange. I'm going to change this so I can get a little bit more uh, situated. See, Magazine Exchange. Um, if, you, if you go uh, magazine-exchange.com and hit their weekly specials, you can see these prices. This is not a secret thing. You don't have to be logged in. This is not anything crazy. Um, you can go and see this yourself. So if you ever want to interested in like, oh, what kind of deals are out there? Here you go. And Magazine Exchange, they do have some decent deals sometimes. Um, not always, but um, they do. I do use them a lot for restocking of stuff that is uh, not normally widely available. We got Boulders, Boulders, uh, Boulders Gate Draft Boosters for a great price, fantastic price. But uh, yeah, it's uh, that price for a reason. We got Magic stuff, you know, blah, blah, blah. And if you want to, again, you can go check this out yourself. This is not behind any sort of paywall. Uh, these prices are available for everybody to see. I'm not even logged in right now. So, yeah. Uh, let's go see what they got from Magic. Now, this is the last place that I know that has 151 UPCs. 
And look, you can only buy these at $75 a piece if you buy two boxes of a Scarlet and Violet booster box. So for every two booster boxes, you can get two ETBs, or UPCs, sorry, UPCs at $75. If I needed to restock anything, cool. Why wouldn't I do that? That's great. Um, I was sitting on some UPCs here recently uh, for uh, since Christmas, but they're gone. They, they people have been uh, coming in and grabbing those, and and they're out the door. Uh, I have no more. I have nothing of 151 left. I think other than maybe a couple ETBs. Uh, if you go to the website cnagames.com, you might be able to find some there. But yeah, again, you can go out and see oh, these other kind of deals. Uh, Crown Zenith ETBs for 350. Uh, that's great. $35 for uh, an ETB is pretty good. Um, trying to, to move these trainer toolkits because I have a single Evolving Skies pack in them. Oh boy! Silver Tempest uh, e are ETBs for $21. Again, remember that's before they were $50. They used to be $40. So, yeah. Um, oh, there's a couple of Paladin Fates things. You know, a decent deal. Um, people laugh at Pokemon Go, but um, I still think it's a, a pretty decent set. Some ETBs. Uh, that's about it. That's all there is. Um, not a great selection of stuff that you know. People walk to my store and be like, "Man, where's all the where's all the cool stuff?" It's 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 just not available. Like 151 is not available. All these things that people want is not available. Um, Crown Zenith is here. At, you know, again, thirty five dollars for an uh, ETB. It's 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 okay, but yeah, you know, there's just there's not a lot on the market right now as far as uh, you know. Sword and Shield stuff is is completely gone. Again, you have a couple of. Uh, Silver Tempest ETBs. Uh, no, we have no uh, like Lost Origins or anything like that available. Uh, again, these trainer toolkits that are uh, what is that? Uh, like eighteen dollars a a single one. You can't get four packs in them that are you know okay. Uh, but stuff like that. That's that's the type of deals that are out there right now. There's there's just not a lot available for people to to really kind of uh, pick up and, and get uh, packs that you know. Paladin Fates, uh, 151, Crown Zenith. It's 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 available, but they're not they're not great deals. And again, I have to break this stuff down. I gotta open all these th these products up to get this stuff. It's not a great way to to source things. So, when people are thinking about like, you know, getting distribution and getting access to stuff, oh, I can get all these things for super cheap. Uh, trust me, when it's in stock, uh, people that buy on the regular, um, they get the the lion's share of stuff. And then, uh, you know, yeah, there's stuff like this that is sitting around. Maybe, you know, maybe if you get lucky or if you want to, if you're valuing this Evolving Skies pack at, at what, eight, nine, ten dollars whatever they are now, uh, that, yeah, this is, you know, it's an okay deal. But all in all, that's a lot of stuff you have to break down to, what, break even at $18? That's four, eight, twelve for packs. And then uh, the Evolving Skies pack for eight, that's like 20 bucks. Again, it's like 20 bucks uh, for six of those. It's it's a wash. You're not really making any money. You're not making any fantastic deals. People that are breaking this stuff down, very very thin margins. Um, it's not it's not any sort of glorious amounts of money. So uh, I wanted to do that. I want to do a little run through and show you guys a couple of distributors that I use to talk about and see what they have in stock. Some people are asking about this. Um, it's not it's not fantastic. This is what I'm working with. Um, yeah. Uh, so what is the actual what's on the market right now? Anything Sword and Shield, uh, it's it's evaporating. It's, it's I think again those ETBs, the Silver Tempest ones, are the like the last holdouts of that kind of era of stuff. Anything else from that era, Brilliant Stars, Astral Radiance, all this stuff, it's, it's not out there. It's not it's just not available right now. Um, again, you have these products that have a few packs of them, but it's 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 not great margins. Again, you're you're paying up on these because they know that they can. Um, I love mag magazine exchange, but they do be doing that. It is what it is. Uh, I use them a lot, trust me, uh, and they're a great company to work with. They absolutely are, but uh, yeah, sometimes they're deals, sometimes they're not. But again, I wanted to throw out there and show you guys what's what's on the market, what's available for wholesalers to get. It's not, it's not, it's not great. It's not great um, right now. It just feels like a lot of. If you don't want, if you don't want Scarlet and Violet, it's just there's nothing left. It's all drying up. Um, not to drive FOMO or anything, but this is this is the reality of what things are. People are using PokemonCenter.com as like a, a reference point. It can be true, it cannot be true. 
a lot of the time it's not uh, 100% because, you know, distribution chain is different from Pokemon's chain versus, you know, MJ Holding and, and those people that box, uh, you know, are stock big box stores. All these guys, they source from different stuff and they have warehouses all around the country that have different types of products and different quality and, and different things. Uh, it's, 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 it's a reference point just like anything else is, but, uh, you know, using several distributors, you kind of get a better idea of what's going on and what's actually available. And to be short and brief, uh, there's not a lot. So, uh, yeah. I appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully this gives you an idea of, like, what stores are going through, or what stores are looking at, and what's available to them. Uh, if you have questions, hit me down in the comments. But uh, other than that, appreciate y'all for watching. We'll be back with another video soon. Okay, bye.